<laughs> All right, it says the sound wave is modeled as uh, uh, modeled as this thing. What is the maximum change in pressure, the wavelength, frequency, and the speed of the wave? So this is once again um, testing you on do you remember the standard representation of traveling periodic wave? So what that looks like is a function, it's a function of position and time, would look like the amplitude or what sometimes called the maximum displacement times sinusoidal function, uh, where the argument is given in the form of kx minus omega t. So in this particular case, all the, uh, the terms are written that way. So here's my a, here's my k, uh, here's my k um, in basic SI unit, and here's my omega. So um, just plug that in here. This amplitude A should be maximum change in the uh, pressure. That's usually what people mean. It could also be double the amplitude, but I don't think it means that. For the wavelength, you need to remember the relationship between wave number and wavelength. Wave number is 2 pi divided by the wavelength. So solve that for wavelength, plug in K that you find here, then you're done. Uh, for the frequency, you need to remember the relationship between angular frequency and frequency. The angular frequency is equal to 2 pi times frequency this two pi serves to convert unit of cycles to unit of radians. And quotation because neither of them are real units. <laughs> uh, but you know, it's important. It, uh, it involves a vector of two pi. Um, so solve this for frequency, plug in the numbers and you get the frequency in Hertz. Um, yeah, and I have a feeling that when it says one decimal place, that's like five significant figures. So watch out. <laughs> um, with the, finally the wave speed, you once again use this expression that you have seen multiple times. Wave speed is equal to frequency times wavelength. By the way, I think I remember this is the one expression I emphasize a lot for my physics 10 because this uh, uh, you do come back to that a lot uh, as a way of trying to relate these what seems could seem like a disparate uh, quantities and waves. So. Um, yeah, just make sure when you use frequency, you don't use the rounded version, you use the, uh, the number with the unlimited precision. 